Well, here in theCUBE, we have been fact-checking a number of the misleading claims that have been made in recent days by Russian officials about Bucha, including by Sergei Lavrov, the Russian foreign minister, as well as, as you just heard there, the ambassador to the United Nations. The first of those is that the killing of civilians in Bucha has been, quote, staged, supposedly after Russian forces left the town. However, if you look at satellite images, they show that bodies have been lying on the streets of Butcher for two weeks before Russian forces claimed they had left. These images, which were produced by Maxar Technology on the 19th of March and were first reported by the New York Times, these images, they are a direct contradiction of what Russia has been claiming and there is mounting satellite footage and drone images like this also casting doubt. Russian officials have also claimed that there are so-called crisis actors involved, that perhaps in one of the videos of these butcher victims, you can see a body moving. It's a claim we've seen being spread throughout the war, but once again, that claim is false. It has been debunked numerous times by independent fact checkers. And here in the cube, we analyzed those videos of some of the victims in Butcher and compared them to images that were taken by Agence France Press on the 2nd of April. As you can see here, the images show that the locations and the exact positioning of the bodies has not changed. This is further evidence that there were no such crisis actors in Butcher. On top of this, we're also hearing a number of witness testimonies, people speaking to Euronews, other broadcasters, and other international and independent NGOs, many people alleging war crimes committed by Russian soldiers against Ukrainian civilians. So, Helena, while Russia continues to deny these allegations and they claim that the Bucha mass killings were, quote, staged, we can see that the independent evidence against Moscow is mounting.